ever tried deleting a folder and got hit with access denied or you need permission from system you are not alone windows locks down certain folders like their national secrets but in this video i'll show you exactly how to force delete any folder even system protected ones using just command prompt and to make your life easier i have made a one click script you can download and run instantly the link is pinned in the comment section let's force delete any folder and fix access denied or permission errors open command prompt press windows plus r to open the run dialog box Type CMD and press Ctrl plus Shift plus Enter to open Command Prompt as an administrator, which is recommended for full access. If you don't run Command Prompt as an administrator, the command may fail due to permission restrictions, especially on system or protected folders. The first step is to take ownership of the folder. Type Take Own. This command takes ownership of files or folders. F Path to Folder specifies the folder you want to take ownership of. Navigate to the folder in File Explorer. Hold down shift, then right click on the folder. Click copy as path. And paste the path into the command by pressing Ctrl plus V. It will look like this. R stands for recursive, which includes all subfolders and files inside. D Y. You now own the main folder. Windows has updated the security settings to list your user account as the folder's owner. Each individual file inside the folder was also updated. Ownership has been successfully transferred to you, the user, which is required before making changes like editing or deleting these files. The second step is to grant yourself full control permissions. Type ICECLS. This command manages file or folder permissions. Path to folder is the folder part you are giving permissions for. Grant username F grants your current user full access rights. The T applies the permission change to all subfolders and files. This matters because many protected files and folders, especially leftovers from programs or malware, cannot be modified or deleted until you own them. This step is crucial for deleting access denied folders, removing malware or locked system files, and modifying folders created by other users or services. The third step is to remove directory and content. Type RD. This command is used to remove a directory. S removes all subfolders and files in the folder. Path to folder is the actual folder path to be deleted. Deleting the folder using RDS will permanently remove it without turning it to the recycle bin. Double check the path to avoid accidental data loss. A prompt will give you one last chance to stop before deleting. You type Y to confirm. Now I know typing these commands one by one can be a bit tedious and prone to errors, especially if you are dealing with stubborn or permission locked folders. That is why I created a ready to use script that automates all these steps for you. From taking ownership, granting full permissions, to safely deleting the folder after a final confirmation. It's fast, reliable and perfect for fixing those annoying access denied errors on Windows 10 and 11. To use the script, download the script from the link in the pinned comment below. Open the downloaded file. Now you would have to open the tool and extract its content to the default location. From there, you can now select Run as Administrator. This gives the script the full access it needs to work effectively. Now confirm the prompt to use the tool. Enter the full part of the folder you want to delete. To get the folder part easily, like I spoke earlier, open File Explorer, find your folder, hold down Shift and right click the folder. From there, click Copy as Path. Paste the path where the script is asking. The script will first take ownership and grant permissions automatically. Then it will prompt you to confirm deletion. Type Y to proceed. We confirm by typing Y once again and watch the magic happen.
the script deletes the folder and all its content recursively. If there are no errors, you get a success message. The script saves you from manually typing complex commands every time. It handles permission issues automatically. It is perfect for removing stubborn folders, leftover malware files, or anything stuck between access denied errors.